Hello everyone, welcome to Mo CD Culture Show and Tell. And on this episode, I want to talk about a band. Well, I only have two albums. From here on in, I'm going to be talking a lot about bands. I may only have like maybe two or three albums in their in their catalog. But it doesn't again, it doesn't mean I don't like the other albums, and doesn't mean I don't want them and won't get them eventually. I will eventually try to get them all. But what I do have is always, you know, the most essential, most important ones I can find. So, this band doesn't have, although they don't have too, too many albums, the, the, their second album is the one I really need. I had it once before with the, with well, I'll get, just, I'll get to it when I get to it. We're going to start off with first with, with my introduction to to this band of course we're talking about Prozac and this album is Hot Show now how I got introduced it was a 30 second commercial on much music you know here in Canada it wasn't MTV it was much music and it was a fantastic channel but yeah because of much music we, you know, it and it it showed like because it was thirty seconds they were promoting this album, and it was thirty seconds of the video for for the third track here, which I well actually track number four on this, which I will get to. It was because of that the way that video looked and and the and then after and then oh trying to see that video trying to get the the look at the the see that video i was i i my eyes were glued as much as i could to the to 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 much music that that you know that week i i had to see the actual full length video and they since made two different videos the second one is the animated video with, with them in it that's all animated but i'm talking about that first video that rave video for the well for the track i'm a ball of charade it's track number four but it has a little cool little intro and then again two fantastic songs to start off the album you know europa and strange disease and there's pretty much videos for everything on this here. They have they they can't I can't find it on DVD. I don't think it exists on DVD. But I used to own it a long time ago on 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 uh, VHS. The Hot Show. It was like a Hot Show. You know, uh, VHS kind of had all the videos and everything and a little cool. Oh, I I used to love that. I, I don't even know what really happened to that, but I missed that. I wish they had that on DVD, and I wish I had that in my collection. But unfortunately, I don't. But it has that little intro, Europa, Strange Disease, and then Amabala Shere. Now, when I bought this album, I I played Amabala Shere, okay? I swear, and I'm not joking. 30 times in a row. I just had that on repeat. I couldn't get enough of it. I, I just love that song. I'm a ball of charade. Hey, hey. I really want to see ya. Oh, yeah. Then then track number five, Shag Tag. You're it. Hot Show, the title track. Mediterranean Lady. Then there's Wild Thing, Poor Boy Medley. And sucks to be you. Now I'm gonna. I have a very cool, little interesting story about those those tracks. During the time when this album came out, and if I can find my trusty magnifying glass, we're right here. And this came out when it was night. Yeah, of course it was 1998. At that time, there was a club in in Moncton here called the Cosmo. And it was a it was a weekend, you know. You go on a Saturday night, and you know you try to go over there. Well, we go there to try to pick up girls and that. But it was a dance club, and you know it was a little bit of a meat market, if you will, if you will. But they they often play great music in that, and it was it was the first time I decided I, I'm going to bring this CD 
over to the club and have them try to play. I want I want to play. I want them to play. Sucks to be you, you know. That that'd be awesome. That's what I wanted them to play. I I give it to the I, I give it to the DJ. What happened to kind of be sort of a friend of my buddy, you know, that I went with at the time. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry. And so then when we so so yeah and I remember at the time okay be just before he ended up you know playing the song right the dance floor wasn't wasn't really it was maybe a third a third full okay one third of like capacity full it could be it could be more it could have been more lively then he goes and he goes and he puts it on and then he puts on the wrong song. He puts on Wild Thing Poor Boy Medley instead. You know, the song just before Sucks To Be You. I really wanted him to play Sucks To Be You. But it didn't matter. As soon as as soon as soon everybody in the club heard it, everybody, everyone made a beeline for that dance floor and it got the place pumping. And the look on the DJ's face was kind of was kind of shocking. Now, uh, uh, connected to that little story of of him playing those songs, his girlfriend, okay, which I had no idea was his girlfriend at the time, was hitting on me. And I had recently gotten a tongue ring, which I wore for only about eight years. I had since taken it out because it was just, yeah. But I had uh, I had a tongue ring for about eight years, and so so here she was on my lap, like you know we're French kissing, and she's sucking on and she's sucking on my tongue and on my tongue ring, and the DJ who still has my my CD in his possession, you know, is getting pat pissed off. But I don't know that it's his, you know. It's my buddy. My buddy comes over and says, "Yeah, that's his girlfriend." And I'm like, "No, no way!" I, 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 I like, I push her off, and I'm like, "Like, I go, buddy, buddy. I'm so sorry. Nope. I, he, you know, I'm not interested. If, if she's with you, I'm, I'm, I, I'm not here to intrude. But you know, you saw she was hitting on me. I would, I, I didn't, I." As soon as I found out that she's with you, no, I don't want anything to do with that. I I'm, I don't play that kind of game. You know, she she's yours. You know, he 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 was okay with that. You know, he didn't really. You know, he he you know, and he gave me my CD back, and I didn't know it was his uh, his girlfriend. But yeah, it's a good thing my buddy told me that it that it, that it was, and then yeah, and so. That's that little story of that. But now, I'm going to continue that track list because it has a New York, which is pretty decent. It's a it's a more mellow song. Some Every once in a while, when I do play this album, I might skip it. But more often than not, I will let the whole thing play. And of course, even the next song I like to watch, which is Milo, the other guy who, who, who sings it. You know... That's another song that every once in a while I might skip it, but mostly I, I will I will let it play. But then the next ones I I, I let everything else play. I let I like tsunami, I like sleep with myself, uh, and Lisa. It's still pretty good. It's a more mellow song, but I I still like it. And then there's Simon's final thought, which is pretty, which is a you know a little ditty that he does to finish off. Like a little outro. This is a fantastic album, and I suggest anybody to pick it up. You know, the first, oh yeah, my my memories of this album. I have very fond memories of of this album. But then, then I should be showing you uh, uh, Saturday People, which is which I had for a while. But then you know, it's I had that own when I was in Montreal and. As, as you may or may not know, I kind of left my some CDs up in Montreal, which I hoped maybe, maybe to see again, you know, it'd be great. 
but then, but, but now, like, yeah, it had that 3D, uh, it had the 3D, like, like, like the Anima does, you know, it could, or the, or the Emotive from Perfect Circle I showed you, you could, you can change the cover and it, it, and it changed, and it was cool, I really love that album, I, I miss, I miss not having it. I, I think I have it recorded on cassette somewhere. I could play it if I need to. Like, I still have it on cassette. And that's the beauty of uh, cassette players. If I didn't show you last time, you know, I want to take a little break. And I want to quickly, a side note, I want to show you my stereo. I want to take this off again very briefly. And excuse the noise, but I am also going to bring the mic with me because I want you to hear me clearly. You know? So here we go. Now that's my stereo. Uh, how well you can see that? Okay. Oh, okay. There we go. There's my stereo. And it has, you see, it has a dual cassette player. I can cause I can record from the CD, TV, ca from you know onto ca any, anything from a cassette. I do have some pretty cool mixes that I done. And one mix that I'm very proud of that I got all from the internet and it's it's actually super top quality. I'm just going to really present it here quick in this. It's an odd place for me to, to, to comment on this. But yeah, I'm going to go put the things back really quickly. <laughs> But that was my that's my stereo. I hope you you get to see a little quick a quick glimpse of that. I'm gonna try to get things back organized again because why is that crooked like that? Okay, I'm gonna put the mic back. Right, sorry about this. I just I just kind of want to show you show you my my stereo because yeah. And what I was saying is, I I have I have uh, Saturday people record it somewhere on my uh, and get this down. Yeah, it's weird. Why is that now kind of crooked? Interesting. Well, there, that's fine enough. Anyway, yeah. To reiterate, <coughs> the and it's actually not even in the case right now it's in it's in the player what it is is i recorded the 60s spider-man cartoon classics and it has everything from um, david lined up johnny parsons sid sid dale alan hawkshaw johnny hawksworth Bill Martin, Phil Coultier, Kenny Graham, Keith Mansfield, The Mohawks, William Luce, Emil Kad Kadkin, and Ray Ellis, and more. And it's pretty, and I, it's, it's going to be really hard to see, and I'm not going to go through the set list, but it has all, all that fantastic music that's all from, yes, yeah, in green and, and, green and red it has all that fantastic music from the 1960s classic cartoons it might that spider-man cartoon that early 60s cartoon for me that's my earliest memories and my first real love of, of spider-man for the longest time all spider-man all new incarnations of spider-man i would judge you know from from that first cartoon and I was not always satisfied but in, in subsequent spider-man's it always bugged me that that they didn't do the two different voices for for between Peter Parker and spider-man because that was the way it was always that was the way it was supposed to be you know you're supposed to have a you know Peter Parker and 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 spider and spider-man speak different but that jazz music that they have in there is beautiful 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 i i, I just want to i just wanted to quickly interject this into this video because I, I know it's off tangent to what we're talking about but i promise you we're going to go right back to that subject <laughs>
But yeah, it's the Spider-Man cartoon music is yeah, I, I, I love it. And I'm so glad to have my player so I can have it all on cassette. And it plays fantastic. I love the way it sounds. I wish I could play you some of that, but I don't want to I don't want to push any copyright or whatever. So, now, okay, right back to the topic at hand. The next album, again, is all to say that I wish I had the CD for Saturday People, but at least I do have it on cassette. Now, but I do actually have this album of theirs, and this is the last album I have, so I only have, so I only have Hot Show and, and uh, Cruel Cruel World. And I love this. I love this pretty much almost as much as the other two is, is equally. It has, it's, it's, it's different. But when, but the that first track with that bass opening is so spectacular, it's so amazing. I love the sound of that bass, and I love those. That I, I I'm surprised that that song did not become more popular than it than it, than it, than it was. Uh, it's called "Think uh, When I Think of You." The first track is "When I Think of You," and then that's even that second track, "Tricky." It's it it it's so it's ah it's such a good ah you should check this album out. There's uh, how beautiful, which is awesome. Just friends, starting over. Don't love me that way. Sweeping romance, clothes we wear. It's not so bad if you're ready. Cruel cruel world, cruel cruel world. I want to be loved, and. Today, as I was as I was doing some puttering and cleaning up in, the, in that, around the place, I played both of these today in order. Yeah, I play. Oops, sorry, this is upside down. Yeah, I played this first, and then I played that after. I played them. I played them back to back, and I oh, it was so like. And I didn't skip anything this like when I played it this time as I usually don't is every once in a while like maybe one in in every five plays I might might skip those songs but not today I actually wanted to hear both of these because I, I I love them and then it's like I I'm going to I'm going to be doing some videos tonight I might as well start talking about them because you know. I, I, I love Prozac. I love this band. You know, and if you don't know about this band, please check it out. You just won't regret it. All my music I present here, I'm hoping you check it out. If you, Even if you don't know the band, go back, watch all my other videos. You know, I'm going to conclude here. If you would like, if you could subscribe, that'd be awesome. I, I would appreciate that. But I really want you to like my videos. Leave a like and comment. Make, give me comment. Give me suggestions. Uh, I, you see, I'm trying to shake up my, my repertoire on my channel here. I'm trying to give you some different content. I will be giving you some more. And I'm going to try to give you more and more and more unique inside looks and and open up my world to you guys out there because it's all about it's all about inviting you into my world you know we're like yeah I, I, it's more you I want you to have a personable experience when you come to my videos you know I, I, I yeah I love you all out there so so everybody take care <laughs> be safe have a good day evening night wherever you may be i will see you on the flip side and have a good one everybody later